Unfortunately, the people of Moore, Oklahoma are no strangers to tornadoes and their devastation. On March 25th, Southgate Ripito Elementary was yet another Moore school to have to face the power of a tornado. Vice Principal Christy Olstadt wasn't anticipating any bad storms on that day. There was supposedly really no chance of a tornado in that storm and they started talking about where the damage was and I immediately realized it was Southgate. As fast as we could, both got to the school, started walking through and it sounded like waterfalls because of all the water that was coming in. And then we began to walk the neighborhood to see if any of our children were out or needed help. And At that point, uh, fortunate because none of our kids were injured. No lives were lost and it's all good after that. Southgate Ripito suffered major damage to the West Wing and is unsuitable for students to return. Now the question remained, where are they going to have school? Was the Mayus Baptist Church just opened their arms and welcomed us in and said, set up your school here. What is ours is yours. Emmaus Baptist Church helped Briarwood Elementary, who was in the same situation after the fatal May 2013 tornado. Now with the classrooms figured out, it was time to move on to the little details. You, know, you have to completely establish your lunch, your arrival, your dismissal, your rotations, your flow, your emergency procedures, your fire drill, your tornado drill, your lockdown drill. You have to completely redo that because you have a whole different building. One of the biggest challenges the school faced was that most of the students had never ridden a school bus before. All of the students either walked, rode their bike, or had someone drop them off. For their first week back at school, faculty members actually went to the bus stops and rode with the students. So we needed the parents to know that we were going to take care of their children and we were going to get them to school safely. Safety is our number one priority. Academics is second. We practice our plans and, and what we do, you know, shelter in place over and over and our plans are very detailed. We leave nothing out and we do, we actually do extra tornado drills. In fact, someone said, uh, carry on Southgate strong, and said, yeah, we're definitely a Southgate family here. Students can go back to their desks in the fall, but until then, they found a new home. Alicia Clifton, OU Knightley.